Good morning and hello everyone. This is teacher Abby back again with another video. As you can see, I have a few smiling friends right here from one slash six. Miss Sirirak, I can see you smiling. Nam Ing, I see you happy with Christmas. DJ and Rawisada, I see all of you people there. Now, as often as I do, I have uh, a few uh, icebreakers. I don't know if you guys can find it interesting. Like the one in green, it says, a friend of my friend is my friend. And so a teacher of my teacher is my teacher. Do you understand what that means? <laughs> Meaning, if Miss Sirak is my friend, but Nam Ing is Miss Sirak's friend, that means my Nam Ing is my friend too, right? And then lastly, I have here in red, it's called a tongue twister. Like last time I was teaching you guys, you have to be able to say it quickly. If you can say it quickly and properly, you would have done very well. You have to say it quickly, not slowly, because when you say it slowly, you can say it well. Who wants to try? Are you ready? Let me give it a go. Listen, no need to light a light light on a light night like tonight. <laughs> Did you catch that? No need to light a night light on a light night like tonight. Remember when you guys come back to school, I hope you guys can say this. I will be asking some of you people, if you can say it, I will give you one canon for you, one candy. Anyway, let's go to the lesson right now. Today, like last time, uh, the lesson is about animals. And as you can see, we are going to start with a question. What animal do you like? For this example, I'm going to put Hino, Mr. Hino. Hino is a boy in grade one slice six. He wears glasses. Very eloquent gentleman. <laughs> Always asking teacher Abby questions. But anyway, Hino, if you're listening to me, this doesn't mean that you like this animal. I'm just using your name to be able to explain to your friends how to answer this question. And as you can see, I have this line, and then I have line number one, line number two, line number three. I'm going to explain why one, two, and three are wrong. So if I asked you, what animal do you like Hino? Hino needs to say, I like rabbits. Do you see the S here? The S is in red, why? Because the noun at the end has to be a plural noun. Plural meaning it has to be said in an infinitive way. I have a little bit of tie here for explanation. I don't know if you guys understand it, but yes, that's what we have to say. We do not say, I like rabbit. No, this is why I crossed this one out. We do not say, I like a rabbit. Nope. And number three, we cannot say, I like a rabbit. Number three, you would have mixed the plural and the singular. So this cannot be said. Say for example, um, I say, what animal do you like? Fasai. Now, Fasai, in one slice six, Fasai likes hedgehogs. So she will say, I like hedgehogs. You see the S? Fasai will say, I like hedgehogs. How about if I go to one slash five? One slash five, I have uh, Mr. Caramel. I say, Mr. Caramel, what animal do you like? Caramel says, I like penguins, as you can see, right? The penguin needs to have an S. I got one slice three and I say, 
Alice, baby. Alice, what animal do you like? Alice says, I like monkeys. The S, the monkey has to have an S. And then I go to one slash three. I go to mm, who? Achiraya. I say, Achiraya, what animal do you like? Achiraya says, I like giraffes. Do you see the S? Right there. I go to one slash two. One slash two, I go and I ask Mr. Mickey. Mickey, one slash two. Mickey, what animal do you like? Mickey will say, I like lions. Oops, it's a small s, sorry about this. Mickey says, I like lions. And then I go to one slash one, and I ask, who am I going to ask in one slash one? I will ask, who is one slash one? Uh, Mr. Chicken Man. Uh, who can I ask? Kieran, Charlie, Charlie, Mr. Charlie, what animal do you like? Charlie will say, I like chicken. Now, chicken, we cannot say chickens. Charlie will say, I like chicken. Chicken, no S, so we leave it like this. Do we understand? Do we understand everyone? Okay, good. Now, let's go to the book and let's try and see if we can go and read about a few other things. Now we come here. What are the new animals we have to learn about today? A. Listen, point, and say. One. Duck. Duck? Can you spell duck? Two. Goat. Can you spell goat? Three. Cow. Can you spell cow? Next one, we go to a short conversation. B. One. Listen and read. Look, they are going to talk about their favorite animals. On the farm. <laughs> what animal do you like, Grandma? I like ducks. What animal do you like, Grandpa? I like cows. <coughs> what animal do you like, Kim? <coughs> Help! Haha! <coughs> <coughs> I like goats. Uh, Kim, I hope this is Miss Kim from One Slice Six. Miss Kim. What is your favorite animal or what animal do you like? I hope you like gods too. Next one. B. Let's go and sing a song. C. Are you ready? D. Listen. Sing along. So, I'm going to be pointing my mouse to the words in red. You can follow and sing along. What animal do you like? What animal do you like? I like ducks. I like ducks. What animal do you like? What animal do you like? I like goats. I like goats. What animal do you like? What animal do you like? I like cows. I like cows. Did you see that? Everywhere there is S, cows, goats, ducks. Now, I'm going to ask you a question and I'm going to pause. You people have to use the same structure as I use, the same sentence. For example, number one, I will ask the question, what animal do you like? And you will say, I like goats. Please make sure you say the S. Number two, what animal do you like? As you can see here, you will say, I like fish. No S on the fish. Number three, what animal do you like? 
I like dogs with an S. Number four, what animal do you like? I like birds with an S. Number five, what animal do you like? I like cats. Number six, what animal do you like? I like ducks. Number seven, what animal do you like? I like cows. Ready? Now let's go to the game and then I'll go back and explain everything. The game All right, listen. What animal is this? Is it a duck, a goat, or a cow? Goat. Goat. Spell goat. Number two, what animal is this? Is it a duck, a cow, or a goat? Cow. Spell cow. Number three, what animal is this? Is it a duck, a cow, or a goat? Duck. Duck. Well next, done. Next one, please listen and point to the correct answer. Duck. Where is the duck? Is it A, B, or C? Duck. Number two. Cow. Cow. Where is the cow? Is it A, B, or C? Cow. Number three. Goat. Goat. Where is the goat? Is it A, B, or C? Goat. Click to finish and then let's go to the next interesting part about this game. Well done. Uh huh. So, what are you going to be required to do? I like birds. Look at the pictures. Where is the picture of I like birds? Can you find it? Yeah! Next one. I like goats. Can you find the picture for I like goats? Yeah! Next one. I like cows. Can you find the picture of I like cows? Next one, I like ducks. Can you find the picture of I like ducks? Yeah! Next one, I like cats. Can you find the picture of I like cats? Yeah! Next one, I like dogs. Can you find the picture of I like dogs? But please remember, let's go back and review. When someone asks you, what animal do you like? Go back to the Hino example. Hino will say, I like rabbit. But Hino has to put what? Hino has to put an S on the rabbit. Why? Because we always talk about things we like in plural form. Do you understand? We do not say I like rabbit. We do not say I like a rabbit. We do not say I like rab a rabbit. Okay? Please, when we go to the worksheet, read the three sentences properly. If you don't remember what teacher Abby explained, go back to the video, watch again, and remember how to answer. Okay, all right. I guess I'm going to stop here today and hopefully I can see you guys next time. Have a wonderful, wonderful time. Okay, and goodbye.